I love a good Friday morning at Target. It's so quiet. Look at this. You can kind of see behind me. The whole parking lot is empty. This idea of professional polished looks is so important to me. Ever since I was a child, I had a goal. There is nothing better than the feeling of doing what you love and being really successful at it. When I was about 33, 34, um, I couldn't afford really beautiful, high and elevated fashion. I couldn't afford it. So I got really, really good at going to places like Target and TJ Maxx and Nordstrom Rack and shopping sales. I got really good at it because I knew if I could find a really good piece that I could show up to the boardroom or a one-on-one -on -one with my manager vying for that promotion looking and feeling elevated and, and really good about myself. So whether you are someone who can afford the $650 blazer, or you're someone who is just really trying to hustle and make it happen and you can't afford it, it's you and me today, okay? It's you and me, wherever you're going, whether you're a mom just trying to feel good at home with her babies, or you are an executive, who needs to present in front of her investors. All of this today, this is all for you, okay? Uh, it's 7.57, I think we can go in now. I'm gonna go wait at the door and be one of those people. <laughs> So good fashion is compound interest. Here's what I mean by that. When you put on a really good piece that makes you feel really good, it acts like a lever. It is like an instantaneous return on your energy, your power, your confidence. We could literally put you in this blazer right now and if it fits right and you love how you look, all of a sudden we get compound interest in every other area of your life, meaning we get returns, we get more energy, we get a quicker way to manifest. You can feel clearer, you can feel better about yourself, you can open up your heart to new things. And all of that can happen by one really, really good piece of fashion. Think about this. If you feel sexy and desirable, how will that impact your relationship with your spouse or your partner? How will you act differently, talk differently? Uh, how will it improve your confidence, your self-esteem? Just that alone, much less your career and what it can do in your career, what you ask for, how you show up, what you say, what you don't say. This is why I love fashion so much because it gets you that return on investment like compound interest super quick. Okay, so we're in Wild Fable. This is a little bit more of a Junior Z brand, but I'm not mad at how it fits. One, I love the color. I think we could do a lot with this color. Um, I love that it's oversized. I think it's gonna look good. And, it, and by the way, the range of sizes goes all the way down to double extra small. So this is the first look I'm picking up. I think it's really good. You can wear this. I see it with a black top under and either black pants or I'm gonna show you the matching pants. By the way, if you don't like this purple, this is a very trendy color for the spring, you could just go with black. Like this is such a good oversized black blazer. It's only $38. So with that, like I said, you, you can do a black top and black trousers or you can actually match it with these cute trousers. And that's a lot of purple, I know. So you have to really be ready for that. That That is definitely a look in and of itself. This is the other thing is you could do an ent entire monochrome look with this top as well. But it's a good enough material that I think you can get away with a really polished professional look. Here's the white as well. Some of you might really love this color, but a black tank with this and you have an immediate polished look that it's just really good. Okay, for those of you who work in an environment that is a little more casual and denim would be something you wear, I am absolutely loving this denim trench. It's belted, it's so thick and high quality. I mean, you could even wear this on like a casual Friday to work, but a really good shoe would dress this up as well. What I would do is I would do a monochrome look under it. So I would do all black or all green. I mean, wear your favorite color, wear the color of the year, which is like a peach fuzz all under it. You could do slacks with like a bodysuit under this, 
or you could even do like a beautiful dress or a skirt. This just elevates. I'm telling you, it just elevates. People will look at you a couple times during the day and it's because of the lapel and it's because you're going for it with the trench. Okay, I've moved on to a new day. I'm pausing here because I like what's happening. Not only is Target coming in with new colors for spring, we're gonna talk about the neons, which is very interesting. <clears throat> but also, I really like that they're pairing it on the rack with a, like a linen, their version of linen. So this brings up a really good conversation around monochrome. With monochrome, you want the similar tone but you can mix and match fabrics. And look at how beautiful this is for the spring, summer. You throw a really beautiful blazer over this. You could really, really make a statement with something like a satin tank and a wide leg trouser in a different material. You could also do satin as well. Just make sure the, the tone of the colors match. But I just obsess over this as a polished professional look in obviously the color of your choice. So let's just look at this with black. Like this is a much better polished professional look. I do love the neon, but probably it just depends where you're working. If you're like an entrepreneur or it does not matter your dress code, this is phenomenal. Okay, so we're gonna grab this. I'm gonna try this on at home. Okay, so if we want to elevate that menswear inspired trouser from Wild Fable, A New Day has a really nice one too really like this only $35 this looks like it has potential to be really flattering with the cute little belt and the wide leg I don't know how the length's gonna work on this but this is a really really nice grab this is my next thing okay the neckline signals your power I'm telling you ladies the neckline is everything and so start paying attention to what a neckline can do for your shoulders. It can just make a silent statement that shows that you're in charge, that you're in control, that you want to be seen. This is a super simple way to bring a neckline in, but there's a lot of other ways as well, and we'll keep looking. Okay, I'm so excited here for this elevated, polished, professional look. I spent 200 plus dollars on a Carbon 38 linen blazer exactly exact same material this blazer is incredible if nothing else today please get this blazer please 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 it's only 38 dollars. i wish i could buy them all <laughs> and then there's also yellow okay another polished look and way to bring it home for work easy 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 you have these really beautiful almost like a lensing material trousers in like this beautiful sage green or this really pretty almost Barbie pink and then of course you have the matching blazer so this is a little bit of a tighter nicer fit than the linen version but you can see the construction is really really good and again you're getting the monochrome here which is really important the monochrome is going to elevate you in a minute this is the compound interest piece I might get this for Valentine's Day this is so cute Okay, Target is loving this neon right now. Pairing this with a satin tank top that we already saw, and then a blazer, like a black blazer. That could be really, really a fun look for the summer months. As I mentioned in the car, my career has come a very long way. Over the last, I would say 15, 20 years, I have been a coach to really big brands, CEOs, multi-multi-millionaire leaders to help them elevate themselves at work. And I didn't realize until recently when somebody asked me what this blazer that I'm building represents. And I said to them, the blazer represents a woman feeling like she is put on her superpower. She turns it on when she puts it on. It's almost like the superhero cape. That's what a blazer represents. I'm so passionate about us women having a place and a voice in this world to be, do, and have everything we could possibly imagine. And as we were talking, I realized that I am still straddling coaching the executives versus bringing all of those tools and skills here. And part of me is afraid to be all in here for fear of that. And part of me is not wanting to be all in on that because I want to be all in here. I am only like bringing a small percentage of what I 
and bringing over there here. And the declaration is that I want to bring all of the tools, all of the things that I have coached them and taught them to be and do and have in their world right here to you. So that's a little bit more about my story and where I've been at, where my head has been at. Okay, well, we are now in Ava and Viv. <laughs> I think I'm saying that wrong. Some of you have commented in the past, it's Ava and Viv. Ava, Ava. Some say Ava, some say Ava. Let's pick up this. So in talking about neckline, I think that also includes the shoulder and the sleeve. Loving this. This is the easiest, most effortless way to, again, get that compound interest. <laughs> you put this on with a really good pair of dark jeans or trousers that I'll show you, and people notice. People are gonna notice this sleeve. You might have to steam it out a little bit. It looks like it's a little wrinkly, but this is $22. Anthropology, mm, it'd be about four times as much probably. So check this out in navy blue. I prefer the navy blue. I think you'll wear it more, but the pink is also really beautiful. I mean, I mean, the pink is really beautiful, wow. Okay, so we're gonna grab those. One of the trends this year is nautical. Not a new trend, but it's definitely a trend. So as we see these stripes, I just wanna point them out. I don't know why we're horizontal. I don't love that they're horizontal. This is a great example though of the neckline. So see how it's a little bit more extended. It's gonna show a little more of your collar, your collarbone, which I really like. This is an easy pair as well. And the nautical is going to help you look a little more stylish. Okay, here's one more example of a neckline. Beautiful, the draping is incredible. You know, um, this brand is doing a really good job with the draping. I wish A New Day were, would do the same. This is a dress, so that's a little fancier. Not sure if you would wear that to work, but I wanna show you how you could wear this to work that has similar draping. And that is with these satin tanks. These satin tanks are about a hundred times better quality than the New Day ones. Really thick. Polka dots are also trending. This I would call a Chanel dupe right here, guys. The new Chanel Spring Summer Collection, it has polka dots in it. So just FYI, this is really good. This is just a quick style tip. This is the color of the year right here, this, or it's a range of it anyway. The color of the year is peach fuzz. I was thinking about making a whole video about good color of the year pieces, but Target's already coming out with it. I love this, I love this color. I understand it's not for everyone. There's some people that are not gonna look good in this color, but if you are someone who loves this color and loves how it looks on you, this is such an easy, effortless dress. Love it. <clears throat> I am in the all in motion section and I talk a lot about mixing and matching. I think most of us love to wear a really good athleisure-like piece to work, but I think there's an easy way to elevate it, you guys. And I've talked about this many times. Some, some, I've gotten some criticism, but I'm gonna give you a couple quick tips about mixing and matching the right pieces with work attire to look polished and professional, while also, of course, staying somewhat comfortable. The first piece I'm gonna show you is a vest. Now this vest is yellow, so I don't know that this is the vest, but some of you will look stunning in this color. I think this is the most perfect vest to put under a blazer. I would probably choose the same color blazer and same color pant, like say a gray, a gray or a gray pinstripe if we were doing yellow. I would even say you could do a denim look here, a denim blazer with a vest and then even leggings. So that's tip number one. And then my last tip is, is something like a hoodie. So there's a couple different colors of a hoodie. You could do a full zip without a hoodie. There's a lot of colors here. Look at all of these colors. Or you could do a half zip, which feels very Varley or Lululemon. And you could throw a blazer over that. Super easy, super comfortable. This is all, all in motion. Okay, one and a half hours later, I spent, what did I spend? Over $400 on some of these incredible pieces. I'm so excited to show you. Let's wrap up this video in front of the mirror with these looks and talk about the power in each of them. 
Okay, this is outfit number one, I imagine. This is a woman who shows up to the boardroom. This is also just an everyday, fabulous spring, summer look for the office. Uh, I have the satin tank that we found, which I will show you the fluorescent one next. I've got these linen pants paired with it. And then I just put this uh, Zara blazer on. So notice the Zara blazer is satiny as well, which feels really good together. Really, really good together. So you can throw on any blazer on top of black to black. Even a black blazer would work. But I need to tell you guys, I love, love, love these trousers. They are so comfortable. We love the elastic. Um, this is up one size. So generally I'm a 10, 12. I would get a large normally. I grabbed the extra large because they were all out of larges. Um, and they're a little looser, but there's a drawstring. So <clears throat> I can pull them a little bit higher. There's a drawstring, but it's giving me length because I'm 5'8". I need the length and I even have a little heel on. This is such an easy, effortless, affordable look for you in the office. Okay, so I see this look as sort of one for the creative professional. You can see I have both the Wild Fable purple trousers, the Wild Fable blazer, and then this is a Free People t-shirt. Super affordable and it exudes your power as a creative, stylish, fun professional. This Wild Fable trouser is worth trying because it is very menswear inspired and I think it just elevates. Bringing fluorescent into a professional look, I don't know if I would wear these pants with it. I might actually go with black trousers. So I'm gonna try on the black trousers next. But it is a beautiful pop, a beautiful pop of color. And you can see I just paired it with this H&M blazer. Super easy. The black with the fluorescent is a no-brainer. Yes, yes, yes. Much better. This is definitely your look for the office. Do not be afraid to add fluorescent to a monochrome black look like this. You're already driving professionalism with the blazer and with the trousers, a nice little heel of your choice, but this pop of fluorescence is just so beautiful and so different. Ladies, if you are in the Ava and Vive curvy range, this is such a no-brainer shirt. It's really good. When you manipulate your neckline and your shoulders, that's where your power comes from. So this is what I love about this Ava and Vive top is you can throw a blazer on and you don't even know. So if you take the blazer off during the day, you have another element of style with the flutter sort of ruffle t-shirt. So here's the whole look put together. The thing about linen is it is meant to carry that effortless look all day long, especially in the summer months. I think it really represents the season for sure. So it does, it hangs a little bit more casually and it's just comfortable. It's comfortable and pulled together. It looks so high end. For the price point, it looks so high end. So if I had a magic wand in my wish, I would put this exact blazer and trouser on every single one of you. You can always wear a good pair of black leggings to work. It does not matter because we dress it up with a blazer. We dress it up with a pop of color or the fabric. Again, this is the satin. Best, we dress it up with a pointed toe boot, whether it's flat. For me, this is a kitten heel. These are Zara, absolutely in love with them. Again, this is compound interest right here. This is how we elevate. You're in control, you're in your power. This is owning your power. I love the pop of color, a pink. Watch this though. This is how we're going to add the denim trench coat in. Okay, so it is, it's absolutely pouring outside. I mean, it's, it's been raining like this for days here in Southern California. Okay, so here we are. You're coming into the office. You've got your blazer under, you've got your trench coat, you've got your boots. You're ready for style. This is a casual spring way to do this. Um, but again, you can also just wear a normal like beige trench coat as well. So it's worth owning one, it's worth having one, but I really like this denim one for that reason as well. Okay, so from the boardroom to the babies, wherever you are in life, hopefully these super beautiful 
polished professional looks really help you take it to the next level. This is all about feeling really good because that is your superpower. And when you feel really good, you elevate your life. And that's the goal. Okay, if you enjoyed, please comment below. I'd love to hear your favorite look. I would also, also really love to know how you would mix and match some of the pieces in this video together to bring in your next polished professional look. All right, I'll see you next time.